to the Mr. Brad Warden Show. And today, we have a new kind of popcorn. It's from the Be Happy Snacks Company. And it's cotton candy popcorn. This one was requested by the Little Man of Fire. And it's out of Hollywood, California. Believe it or not, it's movie stars. Now, no. Don't worry, be happy. Just be happy snacks. <laughs> be happy snacks. So they have some uh, popcorn. It's supposed to be pretty healthy. It's extra large kernels, free, low sodium. It's advertised as such. Yeah. No artificial flavors. No artificial flavors. It says from the, the Jamel. Upside. Oh, yeah. No, no. Yeah, this oh, side no. for the. So they can see that. Gluten-free and low sodium. Ooh. And hey. then we see the very it says from our kitchen to yours. 100% what? Whole grain? Family. I gotta try to get the bottom. The Amello family? No, the very bottom. Diamello family, I mean, not Diamello. Crunchy, light popcorn. Alright. Okay, so family business out of Hollywood, California. Be happy snacks. Will we be happy after... Trying this cotton candy popcorn. We will soon find out, little man of fire. Yay. Shall we? Don't eat. The bag is light. No, don't open the bottom one. This Usually is awesome the sauce bottom. Set. Number oh, two, I'm don't explode the heart. What the heck? Oh, oh, oh. Alright, these are huge oh, as advertised. Okay. Oh. Smell. Ah, uh, it smells more. It smells a little bit like cotton candy, but it smells a little bit like a, like a butterscotch. Hey, there's a spooky person over here. All right, so cotton hey. candy popcorn. Can hear you. Anything happens on this show is so wacky. It's not me. I especially awesome sauce. Oh. And then um, awesome sauce is out of her mind tonight. Going in a bunch of clothes and then saying nothing to see here. I want to, and I want. I would like one. Oh, here, here we go. go. They're kind of addicting. It's like they're not completely cotton candy-ish. It's more like a... Uh, it's hard to explain. Oh, they taste like cotton candy. You think so? Yeah. That's the first thing I get. Uh, maybe. How do you not? It's kind of cotton candy-ish. It's not bad at all. It's actually pretty good. The quality of this popcorn is actually pretty good. Can you see the kernel? Can you hold up one of those kernels? Like, it shows a, a big nice kernel. One. It actually bag, is actually, pretty large. They're, they're really large. They're nicely coated, not overly coated, nicely crunchy. They're not like... It's not overly sweet either. They're not too hard. They're not too like soggy. They're like almost perfectly done. Mm -hmm. This is good stuff. I wonder if they do any other flavors. I think they might, but this is this is high quality popcorn. Well, it's good. Especially coming for a, a mode of the bag. Yeah. You should have a bag, it's kind of iffy sometimes. You you have to like cook it to get good. But, I mean, this stuff's really, mm. really nice. Seems very fresh. Mm. Mm. Fresh is what, nice and this snack. thing's been sitting on our stack for a while. For a little and bit. And you're saying it's still fresh? Oh yeah, yeah. It's probably been on our stack for, I get few, like a month. I don't know. A month or two. I don't know. Our stash gets so big. But this is really good. So be happy snacks popcorn. I wasn't so sure about it when Little Man Fire recommended we get it back when we got it. Like, uh, I don't know. But I'm glad we did. For popcorn, I mean, 
Yeah, for popcorn, I'm going to give it a high grade for a popcorn score, 1 to 10. I would say a 9. I'm going to give it a 9. And he gives a 9.5. So I think they have other flavors. We might have to look into that based on the fact that this company is really good. So be happy snacks. We'll see if they have some other flavors and maybe be back with that. This is really good. Would you say that the be happy label is accurate? Hmm. It did make me surprisingly happy eating this. I wasn't so sure. But snackability is really good. Flavor's really good. Just the whole product in general. So. <coughs> oh, I got a kernel down home. Awesome. Oh, I was like, so All right. Crazy again. Oh, other than the kernel. Make sure you don't swallow the kernels improperly. All right. We will see you next time here on the Mr. Brad Warden Show.